2015 or 16. Okay. Uh, the game has not come out yet. <laughs> <laughs> so, but I fully paid. It's it's waiting on Amazon to be shipped whenever the game is released. Oh my lord! But it was officially announced. Yeah, I know. I my uh, my lame friends who love Kingdom Hearts. Uh, it was an arrow, okay. Yeah. Oh, and I could take him the first stock. Eventually, yeah, he's got it. Wow, that was clean. He got a couple of uh, solid straight hits in the corner. Lucky he had to try to force his way out. Couldn't quite make it. I kept, stuff I kept stuffing him. I got doing a really good job of making it back to center. <laughs> it's really tricky with his drift. Oh. Mm. Really tricky with his drift. Uh, but Lucky, very, very quick on that conversion. As we began. I've actually not seen Agla play before this, and I'm extremely impressed. Ooh. Oh. Wow. Looks getting pranked out here. He can't get away. I even got a shield poke on that pair, I think. One of the downsides to angling your shield for shield drop, you expose part of your shield. Mm -hmm. Lucky is doing a pretty good job of uh, forcing way all the way into the corner when he needs to, though. Yep. I could you know, drift in the corner while Stellar uh, has not yielded as much value as, a, as he had has had previously. Lucky, yeah. down full stock. Lucky's, you know, gotten a decent amount of straight hits in, but it's... Found one successful up throw up here. I'm interested to see if that's going to be the route he's going to go for kills. I did miss the crucial first smash GI, yep. which, you know, tips off his opponent. Mm -hmm. Lucky's now very clearly fishing for some kind of killing blow. And there it is. <laughs> once again, getting himself up throw up there. So Lucky now, that's really important information. Lucky can go for it. Yeah. So... And even if, you know, even if the next one is SDI, it's shown that, you know, he can find success there. Hagrid doesn't have a high success rate so far in this match. Mm -hmm. And this match is all that matters for Lucky. <laughs> oh, big land mix up there. Uh-oh. What an angle. Yeah, the, the tough part in almost, you know, that every character has against Fox is that, you know, not only do you have to hit the edge guard, you have to hit it three or four times. Or you have to, you know... Kill him on Firefox startup, which is, you know, committal, and then you're off stage against Fox. So that'll be the third time. I, I do yeah. believe we saw Aglet, you know, had a pretty high success rate uh, with the up throw in previous matches, but. One of the important things about uh, once you play people who are better and better about Smash GI, uh, especially Smash GI up, up, up throw up air and things like that, you can actually change the timing of when you do the up air yep. to make their Smash GI more awkward, or wonkier, or maybe even the angle they're Smash GI slightly incorrect. Yep. Because you'd be up air deeper or further away from them. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm sure that Lucky has, you know, options for if only single, you know, only single hit. Oh. Up and recover really high, make it awkward for Ido to edge guard. More lasers from Lucky, which makes sense in, you know, Puff at 70. Oh my god. Lucky looking good. After the... Actually, you kind of convincingly took the first stock. Lucky found the things that were effective that yep. you needed to, to use to win, and just did them all. And a lot of times, you, I mean, you see that at the very high level. It's the classic, you know, oh, almost lose to somebody, and then next game, body them. <laughs> we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Agla did have some stuff. He seemed to be kind of shook after, uh, you know, after getting up throw up air a couple yeah. times. But so. I I mean, I think Aglet is... Uh-oh. Yeah, I think Aglet knows his way around the matchup, knows his way around Fox. Uh, most of his edge guards look pretty clean. So, seemed to be pretty prepared. Uh, like you mentioned, though, one of the downsides to... Uh, when Puff has to edge guard, she has to keep knocking uh, Fox off. And yeah. Fox get, uh, gets a number of chances to mix you up mm -hmm. over his different recovery options. Yeah. And he has a lot of them. Yeah, and the minute you miss one, he's back on stage and you're on, you know, you're on the side of the stage, you're on ledge, and you're in a compromising position. So kind of saw that happen towards the end of that first game. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's extremely hard to do the first time, let alone the second, third, with different recovery options. Fox is a good character. <laughs> he's pretty good. He's pretty, pretty good. And a lucky opting to not mm -hmm. go for up throw up air until he needs to. Very, very smart. <laughs> if, saw it, if, it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I did get a good amount of smash guy, you know, maybe one solid input. Mm -hmm. But with that weird drift and, you know, lucky moving with Puff's DI. Yeah. It's difficult. Lucky building a little more damage. Has not taken many hits. Been doing a really great job of moving around. Uh, Moving around the little back air wall that Aglet's trying to set up. Yeah, he's finding his. He's 
Lucky's been really specifically punishing when Aglet is trying to land or when he's about to land. Yeah, which you mentioned, you know, one of Puff's most vulnerable positions. Yeah, it's made Alex sca Aglet scared and uh, scared him into shielding or staying on the ground more often. So we're seeing Lucky get more grabs because of it. Yep. Stick <laughs> down here. Let me... <laughs> uh. <laughs> Lucky opting for lasers, which is one way to get Puff to move at you. <laughs> <laughs> With the empty land crossover into wave land. That was cool. We saw Aglet kind of you know, throw out the back air and then try to fade back to cover the edge guard, but not quite fast enough. Because uh, finds success with a grounded option. A wave dash back F smash. Oh. You see a lot of uh, Aglet getting caught in center, sitting in shield, being absolutely overwhelmed by Lucky, and then Lucky being able to, to finish him off there. You have to pick and choose whichever thing he wants to mm -hmm. hit Agla eventually. Yeah. And especially since uh, Agla hasn't had a ton of success out of shield against Lucky. It's pretty difficult to compete with uh, Fox pressuring your shield as most characters. Yeah. It doesn't, you know, even as Fox, it's difficult. Mm -hmm. so. Oh! Uh. Very <laughs> oh. Nice string. Decent damage, but not a kill yet. He's got it there, though. Nice edge guard. So I managed to find some timings on when Lucky is pressuring his shield and just when he shouldn't be landing more than anything else. Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. Like, that would have been a time not to land. Yes. Uh, yes. But by avoiding landing and avoiding dealing with Lucky's uh, shield pressure mix up and like that, managed to bring it back to a more respectable stock count. He just needs one back to a rest, as you say. Exactly. Doesn't even need to rest. Just uh, you know, back throw, put him in the van. That's what uh, I call. It. Wizard calls the Pikachu back throw, put him in the van now. What's that? Does he? Yeah. That is that warms my heart. Also, Lucky just kind of using. Honestly, Fox throw is so oppressive for floaty characters. You can, I mean, you can see Aglet be trying to move out of it and really not being able to escape to anywhere. It's not even BM from on Lucky's end, right? It's just, it's actually, it's good. Kind of, it's, it's so hard for him to deal with it. Interactive damage really quickly. And now that the threat is clearly on the table, you see, you know, Aglet trying to move back, back here, stay off the ground. Although Lucky doing this many drills is. <laughs> One too many drills. <laughs> that was. Uh, <laughs> Oof. No roll. No roll. Very clearly. All right. This Look. is a good second game from Aglet. I think Aglet, uh, yeah, clearly knows his way around Fox. Uh, Lucky just, at least, was able almost every time that um, Aglet tried to land in a, in a position that wasn't opportune, was able to. Yeah, Lucky was able to kill him. But uh, not a not a bad match from Aglet, like you said. That's. There's promise there for him if he keeps coming to stuff. For sure. That's one of the, I think that was one of MDV's 